I want to tell you that 56 years ago was one of the most delightful moments in my life. Mm -hmm. It was delightful because I remember the passage of the Voters' Rights Act. And it was always a time that I felt like that the poll tax would be dead. But I had to buy a poll tax in 1966 in the state of Texas to continue to vote. It finally died out. Let me tell you what I know that when light is shined on, history has shown us when the light is shined on darkness, things are revealed. We've been able to derail this bill that the Republicans have had to suppress our vote in Texas for now. And we have done it by sticking together and coming here and knocking on doors. And the Congress and the Congress persons here have been gracious enough to open them. Mm -hmm. We found a machine and the bills that were here that was dormant, but the 57 spark plugs from Texas mm -hmm. screwed themselves into those, that machine and <laughs> lit it up. <laughs> and we brought to light the need across this country, not just for Texans to be able to cast a vote, but for every American to cast a vote in this country without fear and without intimidation. We may not have the numbers in the Texas House, but we got the numbers of the people of the United States of America who yes. are rising up yes. and they are recognizing the fact that voting is a right and not a privilege in yeah. this country. Yeah. And we are not going to continue to be suppressed and denied the right to cast our vote. We're going to fight. But more importantly, we are here not only to do just that, but we are here to put this struggle to rest once and for all. Mm -hmm. It doesn't make sense for us to continue in this country as Americans to keep fighting the same fight year in and year out because someone wants to exploit other people for their political gains and, and uh, genders. We stuck together. We didn't think we could do it, but we did. <laughs> and we have walked these halls of Congress, and we have walked these steps across here to every office that we could. Mm -hmm. And we've made our case, and we believe that when history is written, it will be written about the 57 spark plugs that God chosen from Texas mm -hmm. to light up America yeah. Yeah. and let them know yeah. that this is a right that they have and it's worth fighting for, and we're going to do just that. Yeah. We're going to yeah. fight today, we're going to fight tomorrow, and we're going to fight until this problem is solved. And that is why we're going to fight here in Congress and if we have to come back here, I'm not saying we're leaving, but if we have to come back here, we're willing to fight. We're willing to risk whatever it takes in order to preserve the rights of our own selves to vote, but those who will be coming behind us.